As musicians, a lot of us rely heavily on sheet music. However, could your reliance on that sheet music actually be holding you back from reaching your full potential as a musician? Let's talk about it. Often when I upload covers, I'll receive messages in my DMs or comments asking for the sheet music that I use. Now, nine times out of 10, I won't have sheet music for this. And the reason why goes beyond just simply memorizing the music or playing by ear, which are two things I've learned to do over the years. But what I wanted to do is to give a little bit of advice and maybe help some of you out who do rely on that sheet music, because I think that something that isn't discussed often enough when it comes to artistry as a musician is the impact of relying heavily on sheet music all the time. Now, this is not in any way a knock on those of you who do rely on sheet music because I personally believe that being able to read music is extremely valuable. Um, it's something that I learned to do early on even before I began playing the saxophone. And then all through middle school, high school, undergraduate studies, marching bands, jazz bands, symphonic bands, you name it, I had to read music. Now, outside of these scholastic environments is where being able to play by ear and being able to play from memory really came in handy. So in environments like playing at church, being able to play at restaurant gigs, playing out and about with my friends, and honestly, even in some of those combo jazz settings that I've played in, being able to now internalize the music and then recall from memory it frees you up to then express yourself. And that's really what I wanted to get into with this video. Oftentimes when you see me play, if I record myself and put a cover up, you'll see me playing with my eyes closed. And the reason behind that is something that I honestly didn't realize until recently. Um, I watched this documentary about this numerical savant. And one thing that he mentioned is the reason why he was so good at it is because he was able to recall images and imagery that he associated with these numbers. Now, this documentary was essentially about the brain and how the brain does such a great job of recalling images and visualizations. One thing that I realized is that when I closed my eyes, I never understood why, but then I started to think about it and I really do visualize the music that I play. One thing I love about music is the emotion that it elicits. I think that music has this indescribable ability to communicate those things that words cannot and for me when i play i love to play with emotion and i like to feel the music that i play and so that gets me back to the point of sheet music relying heavily on it all the time can actually hinder you as an artist now this isn't in any way some referendum on whether or not sheet music is good or bad because it really depends on your scenario however for a lot of you, I know that when you do want to pick up a cover and play it, what you're really saying is that I want to give my own interpretation on this song. I have something inside of me that I would like to express. What I would like to challenge you to do is to start to memorize the music and start to internalize that music. Listen to that music enough to where you understand what it's trying to communicate and then ditch that sheet music. and actually take it and express yourself because i would venture to say that for a lot of us as musicians our goal here is expression and communication we have a message that we want to tell through our tool of choice which is our instrument it may seem hard and it may seem like memory and playing by ear these things are incredibly difficult for some people your brain is incredible because it takes a lot to play an instrument don't ever take for granted your abilities when it comes to you being a musician because that's a skill that is incredible. And I think you may be selling yourself short if you are relying solely on that sheet music to express what it is that you have to say through your instrument. And so I'll end by saying this, that um, again, this is not in any way a referendum on whether or not to use sheet music. It's more so to challenge those of you who rely solely on it to go a step further to memorize it and then internalize those songs and then turn that into an expression of yourself because I think as a musician, you have something that you have to communicate. You have something that you wanna say. So what better way to do it than to take those handcuffs off 
and to give that to the world. So I hope that maybe this helped uh, those of you in some way who are trying to take your musicianship a step further. And what I'll also do with my own covers is when I upload the music, I'll try to write out some maybe choruses and verses. Now, I will caveat that by saying I am in no way, shape or form a savant when it comes to transposing music. So it, it might be kind of, you know, but that said, uh, I will try to get a few of my pieces down on paper for some of you guys who've been asking for it. And um, yeah, so hopefully this helps and I thank you for watching. Take it easy.